You mentioned Johnny Sexton. Uh, in uh, When you were watching him come through at Leinster, did you think we'd be here in 2023 still talking about him as a player? Well, um, I, I definitely, uh, when I was watching him in, in Leinster and coming through and playing with him, he was unbelievably competitive and good. Like, uh, it was very hard to say he was going to be the the player he is because he's one of the greatest in this sport now, you know. Uh, I think he's, what he has achieved in his career and with Ireland, and it's it's unbelievable because we need to put this into perspective. Uh, Argentina and, and, and England are playing for the third and fourth place, but they are not the third or fourth best team in the world. We need to make it, we need to understand that, that for me, Ireland is still the best team in the world now, even with this, uh, and I think uh, France won't be that far off. You you still have the big four, like all the best four teams in the world are the two finalists and Ireland and France. Unfortunately, the 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 road or it, it was you know it was hard, but tournaments are tournaments. But that doesn't. But for you to prove you are the best in the world or the top two, the top three, that you need to prove it consistently, and that's what Ireland did in the last few years. Uh, um, and it's unbelievable, you know, to, uh, f that's my opinion. Eh? Now, uh, obviously, a World Cup is a World Cup and you want, you have to win it and it's it's a tournament. But, you know, for me, they are still, and they have a bright future coming, uh, looking forward, you know.